Hey guys, my name is Rodney and I'm Just a Big Bone. This is day 68 of my weight loss journey and today I am answering another viewer question. And that question comes from none other than Ash, that fat guy who's been a big, big uh, follower and supporter of the channel. So thank you, mate. Thank you for your question as well. His question was, have I ever considered doing like a vlog style video where it's not about any one particular subject where I just show you little snippets of my day. That's a really good question. Um, and I think I think mainly the uh, the main reason why I haven't done many of those sorts of videos is, first of all, I, li I like sort of focusing on, on the one sort of little topic. Uh, that way I, I can get all my thoughts together and, and I can get everything, um, you know, organized in my head. Uh, but also too, I, because I have so many things to do today, and everyone else does as well, obviously, because I've got things on, I like to just get them done and then get them up and and I can cross that off my list. It's not something that's hanging over my head. I'm not getting to seven o'clock going, oh no, I've still got to finish that video. Um, but that doesn't mean, uh, just because I haven't done it, doesn't mean I'm not going to, or I shouldn't, or it's not a good idea. So today I am going to put that to the test and I am going to do a vlog style video. Now, I actually recorded this yesterday um, so I could get my whole day in, but yeah, let's, let's check out what my day looks like and let me know what you think. It's about quarter past seven and I'm off on my half an hour walk and I like to get them done nice and early because again, it's just ticked off my list. And, uh, but before I even get to work, I've got a feeling that I've accomplished something. And, and that's really cool. It sort of helps to get the motivation and momentum going. Ah, oh, that's an idea for Motivation Monday. Um, but you know what else I discovered about this time of the day and what people are doing? You know who else is up at this time of the day doing the same thing? Fit people. Fit people are up right now and, and walking and walking the dogs and everything, doing personal training classes. And so now I feel like I belong to that group. I feel like I'm one of the fit people. So this is good. I finally found my peeps. So I just got back home after a 45 minute walk and I've already done over 4,000 steps for today and that's that's before the day started. So that's awesome. About to head off to work. Got my lunch all packed here, ready to go. Took me a couple of minutes last night. Man bar shaking here when I'm also packing a banana as well. So the man shake is so good um, for just convenience. A couple of minutes to, to prepare the night before, you can leave it out, you don't have to refrigerate, you're not gonna forget. All fits into, or well, pretty much all fits into the containers, whack in my bag and off I go. All right, so it's about 10 to nine and I'm on the home stretch, nearly at the office now. Um, it takes me an hour to get to the office because uh, I live in an area uh, called North Sydney, but my office is in an area called Campbelltown and it's uh, an hour away if I go the, the freeways. And um, I actually nearly saw an accident this morning. Um, going along the freeway, it's 100, and there's this car, and even I could tell it was going pretty slow. And then coming up behind it, there was this truck. It wasn't a huge truck, it was like a little, a little truck, but it was still a truck and it was quite tall. And he's obviously going faster than that car that he's in uh, behind. And I was looking going, oh my God, are you not going to slow down? I thought he was going to smash into the back of his car. At the last minute, last minute, he still hasn't slowed down and he swerves this way so he doesn't hit this, um, hit this car and oh, and he nearly topples over because he's tall he starts rocking backwards and forwards like that and he nearly nearly topples over I thought he was going to do that and it's like he, surely you could you could have seen that it was going to not um, not speed up it was going slow were you gonna slow down anyway um, 
Yeah. So I've just arrived at my office and the gates are all locked, so no one's here. So I go unlock the gates and get inside. So this is where I'm working today. Uh, this is another location our company has. It's a bit of a drop-in center. So uh, we can bring clients here and they can play around with stuff and that. I'm here today because I'm making some training videos for my team. So I'm just gonna park myself in here. It's private and sort of semi-quietish. And uh, it doesn't echo in here like it does in my office. So I'm gonna get some work done and check in with you later. All right, so it's about 11 o'clock. So normally it'd be time for my first shake, but I've got my cold water up at the office. And so this is what I like about the plan, it's flexible. So I'm just going to smash out my first snack right now, a banana. And uh, when I go back up to the office uh, around one, that's when I'll go and have my shake. I like bananas. Uh, so it's just before midday and uh, getting back to the office. I've got a meeting coming up, so I'm going to have a shake before that. But I tell you, all this walking back and forth between the two offices, I've racked up over 7,500 steps. And like I said, it's only just before midday. All right, it's about 10 to 1. And I've uh, got my meeting in about five minutes, so I'm just trying to smash down a shake. So I've finished my meeting and now I've got to hurry back up home uh, so I can get my COVID shot. I've just smashed a man bar in the car, get my snack in. Uh, I get anxious when I'm, I'm sort of fighting around, the, fighting the clock. So I'm sort of feeling a bit that now, but I'm confident I can still make it. Um, during the meeting though, it was really good. There was a, uh, a box of Cadbury's favourite chocolate on on the desk and you know it was a free for all people going for them I didn't reach for one once so that was really good and I even had a Turkish Delight which is probably my favourite in there just calling my name I'm like no no I'm not going to mess up a perfect day so that's another that's another win anyway on to my my shot then I get to go home so I'm back home, the uh, COVID vaccine was done and uh, I'll find out in the next couple of days if there's any symptoms from it. But I've still got to have another shake and some dinner before this day is out. So it's about 10.30 at night now and uh, I've finished up for the night. I'm just crawling into bed and I thought I'd give you one last update. Had a really nice dinner, had some homemade burgers and and after that uh was invited to an impromptu light, late notice uh games night uh just up the road with with a friend of mine they they had kids up and so went and played a couple of games with them uh, and so that that was really good that was really fun i've just got home had a shower uh, i've done over 9900 steps today but i reckon that's actually over 10,000 steps because because of the, the trackers on my phone, I only count steps that I'm carrying my phone when I'm walking. There's probably times where I've gone up and walked around and that without without my phone. So easily 10,000 steps today. So that's that's been a good day. Had my had my shakes, had my um, had my a couple of snacks and, and dinner. So that's that's really good. And so yeah, that's that that's my day. Um, what did you think of this? vlog style you know video where i'm not talking about anything in particular but just going about my day it was it entertaining uh, can't imagine how my my average day is entertaining did was it insightful did you learn anything leave your feedback in the comments below i'd really love to hear it uh tomorrow i'm going to be back in the kitchen making something yummy for big bone cooking school so make sure you don't miss that Hit the subscribe button and follow me on my journey. I need all the help and support I can get. And the help and support I'm getting from you guys lately has been fantastic. So please keep it up and follow me on my journey. Thank you so much for watching. And just remember, I'm not fat. I'm just big boned.